Last time on SV Full Send, we visit a few historic sites around Panama and have to deal with a few more broken items on the boat. You guys silly? I'm still gonna send it. <laughs> so getting the last few things before we head off. Uh, the engine hours are about 400 and you're supposed to change at 500 or yearly and we're about uh, five months over on the yearly. So we figured if we're about to cross the largest ocean in the world, we might as well fix it change up. It up. Change it up. Same thing with the uh, transmission. Uh, the antifreeze or the coolant, we're not gonna change. It's supposed to do it yearly, we read. One set every thousand hours, but we continually add stuff because uh, it's burning off. I don't know where it's going, but we have yeah. to keep adding. Uh, so we think we'll be good with that, but we've got spare on the boat. Um, but the oil is going to be the biggest thing. So just headed to the Do It Center uh, and grabbed some new oil. Uh, and now we're going to go try to find a camping toilet because we have to have, uh, we can't, we have no holding tank. Yeah, and that would be horrible to get into Galapagos and then tell us to immediately leave because we don't have black water certification. Yeah, so we're going to lock the the head or the latrine. And, Say the macerator's not working or something. Yep, and then just use this camping toilet. Um, so we, when we're in Galapagos, we'll be on shore a bunch of those. So. so getting to the last few items and our search continues to find two uh, crew members to join us for the passage. Getting a lot of hits after posting up on Facebook. So uh, hopefully we find somebody that we mesh with that's got enough knowledge, or we'd hope for somebody that's got a little bit more knowledge than us. Yeah. <laughs> um, but uh, yeah, we'll see how it goes. Well, it's raining pretty heavily, and the trash is now floating down this river <laughs> in the middle of the street. Exactly. <laughs> there it goes. Can you go forward so it don't wash away? So we are uh, prepping to leave the Galapagos. Yeah, we uh, tied one off last time with potluck. Last time we were going to see the cruisers. Yeah. And uh, we got a boat fumigated, but uh, we realized when we were driving that we didn't film any of it. Yeah. So it's fumigated. It's one of the oh, requirements. It's got rid of all the little bugs and uh, I have seen a couple cockroaches in there, yeah. so hopefully they're all gone now. Yeah, they're all dead now. Uh, but yeah, now we're going to the airport, crossing the, uh, oh, there's a canal over there. Yeah. But uh, we're going to the airport. We're picking up Don. Don, Don and, and uh, well, uh, and then Nicholas is yeah, coming. Nicholas is coming. Later, he's, right? he's coming down from Costa Rica. But we're yeah. picking up Don. Don's going to be with us from Panama all the way over to French Polynesia yeah. and a little beyond. So uh, haven't met him. Uh, met him on the internet. I uh, was looking for a spot on a boat, and we put an ad out, and yeah. he responds. Like a really good dude, and I think it's going to be a good uh, good time having him on, on the yeah. boat. So and then uh, getting the boat. Bottom cleaned uh, tomorrow. Yep. And then no the barnacles allowed. Yeah, no barnacles allowed. And we're getting our PCR test uh, tomorrow as well. And then shooting off depending on weather. This, sometime this weekend. We're waiting on a toilet to come in. Yeah. All right. So uh, another day in Panama on the highway. Yeah, we've got. And welcome, Don. Just yeah. Airport. So he's coming to join us, and we're showing him all, yeah, all the fun stuff of Panama. I don't know if you can see it, but this guy's been dumping paper for the past, like, mile. The guy has no clue. <laughs> <laughs> or he doesn't care, I don't know. But, uh, yeah, so we are headed back into the city. We're going to do Price, Price Mart, Mart and a.k.a. Panamanian Costco, Central yeah. America Costco. <laughs> we already got the canned chicken, and now I need the vodka and rum. So. Yeah. Got to gotta have that stocked up. Yep, exactly. So, into the city we go. <laughs> so hard on a moving boat. Yeah, oh, respira not all that one all the way up. Big, big business, dude. This is, senora, this is PCR, no, no antigeno. 
bread, bread with the, in the mouth. <laughs> it doesn't look pleasant. <laughs> Yeah, so we're checking out of the country, um, getting PCR tests because Ecuador and Galapagos require you to um, have a negative PCR test even if you're vaccinated uh, within three days of leaving. Um, got the boat fumigated. We're trying to get the bottom clean today, get a certificate for that. That's requested. And then get the toilet either today or tomorrow and then uh, head to the Galapagos. So yep. lots, lots, lots to do in a new. short amount of time. Yep. Uh, everybody's getting a brain tickle now. Nicholas is on board too. Hey, Came in last night. So we got the we got the crew for the crossing over to the Galapagos. Wondering what happened with Kruger at night. Yeah. <laughs> well, we're in Panama City. We won't be back to the morning. Make yourself at home. All right. Well, uh, our anemometer isn't working, so we're gonna have to go up and try and put some WD-40 on. Took off the topping lift. Yeah. Just speak. Let's be coordinate. Okay. Coordinate? Co coordinate. Coordinate. Huh? Oh yeah, baby. So it took the anemometer off, I think that's how you pronounce it. Took this tiny little screw. It was going, but it would abruptly stop once he would spin it. Uh, oil? Oil. Maybe yes. So we just wire brush that. You only brush? Just brush and Just uh, some of the oxidized, the uh, green. Okay, okay. Yeah. And then uh, we took that screw out and then WD-40 the inside and now it seems to be now it seems to be going compared to our neighbors compared to our neighbors so I uh, just need to get it back up there you know what that the looks connection like. in, so oh, when the oil start to working it's gonna be fast yeah yeah so we're happy it's not something big so yeah. nice How much more? This is the top of the mast. This is the anemometer. Anemometer doing problem. Soccer. <laughs> okay. Say hello. Hey. Hello. The full sun here, the mask. Oh, yeah. All right, I don't know if you can see me, but uh, this is our last night in Panama! 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 Oh! Galapagos, here we come! We needed what three cans inside from uh, the canal and moving over here, so to top her off. Easy peasy. Yep, and they're charging 353 a gallon here. So, but good little fill up will be good. It's a hot day today. Just got groceries. Yeah, all the beer we need, fresh produce. Ready to uh, ready to go change the motor oil now. Get this yeah. Well, boat's boat's basically ready to go. Yep. Just clean the cockpit. Just waiting for that storm to pass, but uh, looks like we're gonna have to motor sail for probably a day, day and a half. Yeah. Which is fine. We still have to hop in and inspect the bottom work um, to make sure that there's nothing on there, That's so we don't get turned good. around. So. Yeah. But looking forward to it. Long overdue. Yeah. Panama, you've been great, but it's time to get the hell out of here. Yeah. Oh. Johnny, new addition. Yeah. Well, looking forward to it. Uh, it's going to be fun for those eight days, just uh, out of commute cattle for a bit and uh, enjoy the waters. Yep. Yeah. Happy trails. Should be good. Yep, yeah, yep. Yeah. Nicholas is up, uh, making some last phone calls. We've got to take some pictures for Instagram here. Yeah. Um, 
then get the hell out of here. Yeah. Yeah, we're not uh, we're not going out yet. Cause, whew, Cause this, it is whipping. We are headed out now from Vista Ma Marina. Finally, bye. Minus uh, one crew member. Yeah, minus one crew member. Uh, I don't know if we filmed it yet fully, but uh, we'll get into a little explanation once we get out of here. Uh, yeah, low tide right now, barely any wind. Uh, the big storm system passed that we'd been waiting for to get through. Uh, it was like tropical storm uh, strength winds, so glad we uh, waited a little bit longer. Um, yeah, excited. Uh, hopefully we make it in less than eight days. We'll see. We're gonna be motoring for a little bit because of the winds being absent. But uh, the crew's excited, ready to, to leave the vortex of Panama. It's uh, been a bit, but out into the great blue yonder, the Pacific Pacific Ocean. Leaving Vistamar. Bye, Panama. Get out in that water. You hit pause. You hit pause. Cop copyright when we start editing. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Alright, so Don's on. Watch now. And we've got glass for an ocean right now. And uh, with that glass, we also have no wind, really. So yeah, what's the uh, what's the apparent and the true? Four point two is the apparent. Yeah, no, no. wind speed. Yeah, and as you can look Straight at the on. the sail, it's just kind of. We're going right into her. We got maybe twenty nine miles, so we should need to start uh, tacking a different direction. And hopefully, we'll hit some some better wind coming around this uh, tip on Panama. Oh uh, yeah. Been good. Glad we didn't go out in a giant storm. Yeah. Oh, and uh, that's why we don't have the uh, Mexican Nicholas on with us anymore. He decided that uh, he couldn't make it due to uh, a gig with another boat or at some point. So uh, he ended up leaving, but we were able to make everything work. And that he didn't realize that he was going to have to take COVID tests. And yeah. How expensive so, tickets were. So we, we could have really gotten screwed over, but luckily we were able to work things out. But. Uh, he was trying to punish us for his lack of research and due diligence so yeah our dates on our fumigation and bottom cleaning were all dated as well um, as our covid tests were all dated so yeah and we would be over that extension if we had to check back into panama and then check out and yeah. that would have cost us about 550 bucks yeah. so but luckily he speaks the language down here and was able to wheel and deal and then there were three and uh now we're here making it out but uh yeah, yeah. Cheers, guys. Cheers, cheers. If you enjoyed this video and want to see more, like this video, subscribe to our channel, and help support us on Patreon. You guys silly? I'm still going to send it. <laughs>